May I present um, Mr. Will? Hi there, sir. Hi. Hi um, what's the theory behind fencing? Well, fencing used to be a matter of life and death. 16th, 17th centuries, people needed to learn how to fence in order to survive in case somebody called them out. But it's evolved into a sport. So the theory is about trying to hit your opponent but not to hit yourself, basically, is what it's all about. Um, how long have you been doing this fencing? Well, for far on, for 55 years. 55 years. Um, yes. Yeah. Well, that could be fit. Yes, it helps, yes. yes. Um, how come you've got a black jacket? Well, this is uh, when I coach. I do quite a lot of coaching as well. And uh, when you're being hit repeatedly by a student. Well, there are three weapons. The, there is the foil, um, which is what the people you were filming are fencing, uh, which is a thrusting weapon only, and the target is just the body. Um, and that was developed about 250 years ago as a practice and training weapon and a competition weapon. Uh, then there is the epée, which is a heavier weapon, again a point only, a thrusting weapon, uh, which is a derivative of the rapier. But everything is in the target from head to toe. Uh, and then the third weapon is the sabre, which is a development of the old cavalry sword, with which you can also cut as well as fence with the point, and the target is everything above the hips. Hi there, Chris and Elena. Um, how long have you been doing this? Yeah, about five years. Yeah, two or three months. That is the sort of timing we're looking to get. Basically, Chris can see what's going on and there's a pull sometimes. I don't give anything at all. How old are you? Eleven. Eleven? Do you like doing this stuff? Yeah, it's really good. When did you start? Um, I started out three months ago. How come, why are you doing this? Um, I found this book because my brother started and he was really enjoying it and I've tried it several times for some scouts and activity weekends and I really enjoy it so I thought maybe I'll start. Hi there. Hi oh, yeah. Hi. Um, how do you see the future of the fencing? Of uh, what, fencing in general? Yeah. Oh, it's, it's very healthy. Um, yeah, it's, it's a wonderful sport, it's social. Um, uh, there's plenty of, plenty of room to get your aggression out. And uh, you can hit people with a sword. <laughs> um, there's a lot of mental energy going into it, and it's in short, sharp bursts, so you do get really, uh, you know, puffed out very quickly. Um, and how, um, if someone's interested in this club, how can they find out? Well, uh, the best thing they can do is to look at our website. We, uh, you can find us on Google. The uh, best thing to do, get on Google and type in Bedford Fencing Club and you'll, you'll, you can read all about us and, and find out how to get onto the uh, beginner's course or if you're a seasoned fencer, where to find us and you'll always be welcome.